victory is Joe Cortez. There are three judges who will score the fight on the round system with supplemental point scoring in case of a draw. Three knockdown rule is in effect. No standing eight count. The mandatory eight count is in effect. Tyson in the black trunks and James Quick Tillis in the white. Late in round one, a round in which Tillis has not acquitted himself too badly as he has managed to stay away from Tyson's Thunderbolts, although he just took a right hand. Lost to Tillman in the Olympic trials. Right hand lands flush on the cheek of Quick Tillis, but that was an extended right hand. He won't knock Tillis out with it, but he will wear him down and bring his hands down so he can land punches to the head. He got him with the left, and you saw Tillis staggering backward momentarily. Right now, all of the aggression is out of Mike Tyson. He is keeping his distance. He's trying to learn how to box with James Quick Tillis. Bo Williford said that he had been working with him for the last six weeks, tying up Tyson's arms. At that time, Tyson got the left hand through again after ducking the Tillis bunch. Looks to me like Tillis is open for an uppercut at the middle the same way. Come on, get those arms out. Come on, work out of there. This is an important learning experience for Mike Tyson. He's going to have to be able to handle a quick Tillis to get to the top of the event. He is right now. Tillis. And Tillis is making the mistake of trying on, to trade with on. Mike Tyson. He should be moving off the ropes. Round three coming to a close. And Mike Tyson warms to the task once again as the round. You'd have to say that is a fluke, the loss to Witherspoon. Right, uh, Tillis claims he slipped on some water in the corner and was distracted before he got punched. Again, he lunges in and gets caught. The left hand drops Tillis onto the seat of his pants as round four is coming to a close. All right, let's stay right here and take one more look at the knockdown. I'm clearly wrong. That was just a clean punch. He was off balance. We talked. We said that Tillis could not lunge in with the left hook. He lunges in with the left hook. Tyson very cleverly slips it, comes back in a punching position, and lands a left hook. That was not the full power of Mike Tyson. The longest Tyson bout was the fight against Jesse Ferguson. A TKO at 1 minute 19 seconds of the sixth round. Now round five begins here in Glens Falls. Tyson waiting for Tillis to open up, and those two body punches did get Tillis' attention, and he grabs. Come on, let's Just the grimace on his face alone, I think, indicates that Quick Tillis was hurt by those two body punches. It's been two and a half weeks with Steven Spielberg and crew in Los Angeles, where they called him Dark Gable. There's a right hand by Tyson. And the uppercut. It will be interesting to see how Mike reacts to this. Closing with a flurry. Bell is going to sound. Judge Bernie Friedkin scores it six rounds to four. Judge Allen scores it six rounds to four. Judge Tony Murray scores it eight rounds to two. Defeated Mike 